What's up everybody and welcome back to the channel. This video for the first descendant is part of a series that I'm making one per location basically showing you where you can find all of these records in the game. Now currently there are 61 of these available for collection and unfortunately there's not some big super sexy reward hidden behind these. Uh, there are some titles built into these and actually funnily enough if you collect 50 out of the 61 you actually unlock a massive amount of battle pass xp so that being said if you are still struggling with basically completing the battle pass and you need a huge injection of uh, uh you know rank of points uh before we go into season one you can see here find records 50 of 50 that's going to give you 50k which if you are still leveling the battle pass up to 100 that's going to equate to about 12 to 14 levels depending on where you are in the battle pass so that's pretty big this video today covers white knight gulch and inside this location, you'll be able to find four journal entries in total. There's going to be two of them in uh, the mountaintops area. Well, technically speaking, well, in any case, I'll explain once we do it. But there's going to be two that we're going to be tackling from the mountaintops area. And then there's going to be one in Moongrave Basin. And there's going to be one in Observatory, giving us the grand total of four. So we're going to go ahead and start on the mountaintops or in the mountaintops, whichever way you want to look at it. This is the OG teleporter that you'll have unlocked from the beginning. You can unlock these additional two here. We have to go all the way over to this ridge over here. So I'm going to start over here. But if you have to start over here, simply just make your way around. And this is very easy to spot. This is a large open area with a ridge right over here. Starting off from the teleport over here, this is the ridge that I'm talking about. You can just simply go up here and you'll see what I mean. Large open area. Along the side here, you should be able to spot as you get closer to it, you will see the vision or the journal entry, whatever you want to call it, right along the edge over here. Bam, that is it right there. Oh, hello. So this is it right here. Then for our second one, this is actually quite a bit of a travel. It's actually around the corner over here. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the original teleport here and then we'll sort of just go around there because what we're going to do is we're actually going to go through the transition here and the second one is actually going to be just as we get out over here. So let me show you what I mean. So as we start up over here, we're just going to go down this way through this little cave area. And uh, once we get to the other side, we'll be able to see where the transition area is as well. As soon as we get through here, basically, we should be heading this way. And then what we're going to do is we're just going to transition through this. This is actually going to take us to the hatchery. If you were doing it via the hatchery, you would really struggle to actually get to this one, which is why we're tackling it from this side. So technically speaking, it is inside the hatchery, but we are hitting it from the mountaintop side. As soon as this finishes loading, it's literally right outside the door here. As we come down over here, you can spot it right over there. And bam, that's a two done for the mountaintops. Basically, then next for us would be Moongrave Basin. And in Moongrave Basin, we're going to be going down all the way down to this area over here. So whether you're coming from there or here, doesn't really matter. It's inconsequential. We just need to come to this area of Moongrave Basin. So I'm going to teleport us there and we move from there. Okay, so once we're in the area, let's just get outside so we can see this big open area. You'll uh, see basically a bunch of missions and stuff that are strewn around, everything like that. Big old open area. And like I said, what we want to be doing is going all the way to the back essentially what we're looking for the journal entry is on a there we go on this little ridge over here so as you can see map wise sorry i said it was over there it's more like behind this one here but that's okay uh we still found it and we can just come on over to it and let me get up right next to it there we go boom and then these always give you like a little bit of a cinematic and then our last one for white knight gulch is actually at the observatory and again, it's all the way up at this sort of area over here. So if you don't have these two temporary teleporters, you would have to start here and then sort of make your way all the way up and around. But it is super linear. It's essentially just climbing upwards on a mountain. But I'm just going to start at this teleport at the back here. So as soon as you arrive to this area here, you'll be able to follow my guidance. And the phone or journal entry we're looking for, you can very easily find. See, you'd be coming if you came from the other teleporter, you'd be coming from that side all the way up and around here. Once you see this ramp over here, you know you're in the right place. The phone slash journal entry is very close by here. So as we go over here, you can simply just do a leap of faith down here. Bam. And that is it lying right there on the floor. Happy hunting.
And that's going to be it for the video. Thank you so much for watching, especially if you made it this far. If you're looking for other locations, have a look at the channel. I'm going through these chronologically, so I have two more of these dropping over the weekend, the last two areas of the map. And once you've followed all of these, you will have 61 out of 61. But other than that, it's just super important to me that you have a fantastic morning, afternoon, evening, wherever you are in the world. Till next video, fucking cheers.